everybody. I'm Dr. John. Wellness here in Portland, Oregon. I'm here with Joseph. Joseph and I have known each other for, shoot, many years now. Oh, God, yeah. <laughs> but uh, go ahead and tell them, Joseph, what's your story? How'd you find us? And uh, why do you keep coming back? Yeah, it's, I found this is like the only place in the area that does the Atlas machine and do physical manipulation at the same time. Um, I actually found them because I was looking at a for a Y strap adjustment, yeah. and um, this is only probably one of the only other places that I've ever seen that d that do it. And I saw him on the internet, and I came in here, and I realized he was probably the best chiropractor <laughs> I've ever been to. So I've been to countless chiropractors, probably at least twenty, and um, this place is awesome. So yeah, I definitely keep coming back. We appreciate that. Yeah. Well, Joseph tends to have a very tight spine. He lives on a farm and does farm type work often. And so that's part of the reason he keeps coming back. Yeah. So let's get you laid down. Okay. So for Joseph, we know there's a couple key areas here on the shoulders is one, definitely right at the top of his neck and then always this middle back. So we're yeah. kind of just feeling things on our way down. Joseph, is there anything recently that's been standing out for you? Um, just like right where you put your right there on the mid back. And then I feel like I got this, this last few, like that week and a half, this whole muscle is in spasm, it feels like. Okay. Over there. But literally from where the mid back, right there, right there. Even some of that? Yeah. Ooh, something just moved along yeah. your ribs yeah. here. Oh, yeah. It's been really bothering me for about three or four days. Yeah, that's a little bit different pattern. I, I know Joseph's body pretty well now because it's it's been years. We've kind of seen him come and go through little injuries and and incidents. That do okay as I push out? Yeah, that's great. So this is a little bit different pattern than you typically get right here, Joseph. Yeah. feels like this kind of rectangle yeah. like that. Oh, yeah. oh, it's all the way from the mid all the way down. It's very odd. I've had it once before, but I, 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 went, I went a while without seeing you. And I think it just got finally to where it went into spasm. It's weird how it's all the way up to the mid back, though, just about. Yeah, it trails. Uh, Joseph's a very skilled patient now too because I'm pushing some deep pressure here and he knows to just breathe deep and he's letting those muscles relax and just letting them stretch as I push through it so good job being skilled. I'm going to check a little bit of low back, then we'll jump up onto the shoulders. Your low back's kind of a medium today. Yeah. It's, there's tension, but it's not as bad as we felt. I've kind of got a little bit back on my diet. <laughs> well, that is an interesting fact. So when Joseph is being good about his diet, he, what is it? Carnivore diet, essentially. Carnivore diet, yeah. So really just eating meat and the inflammation in his body just melts away. The level of tension across his muscles just has a dramatic improvement. So I'm always encouraging him to be good at that. Yeah. Taco Bell is so tempting though. <laughs> it's right across the street. <laughs> there, there are days it's over There's there. There's meat on it. There's meat on the nachos. <laughs> <laughs> Everything else uh, in it try, is Trying to justify it. Yeah, right? trying to justify it in every way possible. Yeah. 
muscles are letting go decent today. Yeah, not not as definitely not as tight as last time. Okay. I'd say mid mid last year you went through a phase where your back was just locked. Mm -hmm. Then he started the diet, and it was like over the next two months. We must have seen each other three or four times. Yeah. And it was like each time I saw him, the the level of tension on his back was just half as much. And you got to where you're doing pretty good. Then yeah. he's been a little bit of ebb and flow recently. Yeah. You know, with the the time that you're talking about, I was really on that diet. I didn't I didn't deviate from the diet at all. Massage gun just does a nice job getting blood flow kind of into the area that we want it to and warms up these muscles a little bit so that it's easier to just move them the way we need to. Alright, good so you're halfway cozy there. We're going to start at the top. I'm going to be into this shoulder first. Good again. There we go. Coming to the far side. Good. Let those shoulders even out. Nice push straight through. Let that breath just slow a little bit. You're taking good big breaths, but you're taking them fast enough, you're getting ahead of yourself a little bit. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Let this one go kind of medium. That's it. a little bit. This area is pretty locked up, so yeah. we're going to come back to that as you roll over. Okay. And we'll make sure we clear everything that's there. Holding your hip here. Table's gonna pop. Follow that through. Good. I'm gonna come around to the other side. Good. Nice. Supporting this side, we just set this side. Get it here. All right, let's have you line with this side up facing the doorway. And you can be a tough low back sometimes, so we gotta make sure we get him rolled around just right. If we don't, we gotta reset up for him. This goes back, this goes forward. Really let that air out. Nice. Oh, let me steal the mic off your back before you. Oh, roll. yeah. Great. And all the way over to that side next. Good pull on this arm. Over there already. I'm going to slide your hips this way a little bit. I 
wonderful. Just drift towards the floor, let that hip slide, and a big breath out. There it was. Let me get that mic one more. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Great. I'm going to set it right here by your hip. Cool. The leg stretches. Set lower legs. Set the hips. So this is just some decompression on the lower back, that area that we just worked on. Just kind of open that up so you can see me just leaning back into it and just stretching both hips down. Work on this foot. More, there it is. off the end. I get in trouble if I do that. A little more on this side. Really let that knee just drift. There's the hip. Okay, slide on up. Oh, yeah. Middle back spot that was tight. Yep, cross these arms is pretty good. I'm gonna take this one underneath. Oh, yeah, always good. That's it. Double check in that area. There's next spot down, same thing. A little more. That's it. Yeah, it's nice. clearing. Okay. And that's why it's good we check that, because there's yeah, no way to get down there. It was locked up, that's for sure. You doing okay? Oh, yeah. Do they say pain is beauty? <laughs> beauty is pain. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Since I like it better that way. More beautiful every time you come then. <laughs> right? <laughs> I should look like Tom Cruise by now. You're almost there. <laughs> I do all my own stunts. <laughs> whole upper trap and I'm just kind of doing a pin and stretch through it. Just biting onto that and just stretching it wide. Middle back's really your tightest thing right now. Mm -hmm. You got some tension in your neck, but it's kind of just melting away as we push through things. Mm -hmm. That's what we want. You're doing pretty good here. Yeah, it's kind of odd. It's like the mid back to the low back. This that it's usually not like that. It kind of likes your upper back more. Yeah, it usually stays more in the upper back. But that's odd that my low back was my low. You been doing bicep. anything different recently? Been well, I've, been snow, I've been snowed in, so really, if I've been doing anything more of, it's been sitting on my butt, not doing a whole lot. <laughs> okay. Which you been doing shoveling? No. Always driveways. Okay. No. I seem to like. I seem to be better when I'm more active. Like when I'm doing jujitsu and stuff, I seem to be a lot better. Yeah. And looser. Our bodies like to move. Mm-hmm. I'm just working our way up the back of the neck here. Each each movement, we're just kind of going another segment higher. There we go. So we start to roll up into the skull. We know we've got them taken care of for muscle stuff. So let's get. It. Checking on neck things. Okay. Lower neck. This is a pretty good push kind of down and through. 
Beautiful. This one's similar with a little more like around the corner. Yeah. That's feeling decent. Let's put a Y strap on you. Mm -hmm. We'll get an adjustment that way. We'll sit you up, we'll work down the shoulders and arms. First one's just a stretch. Awesome. That feels okay? Mm -hmm. The grip on the neck is nice? Mm -hmm. Looks good. So, another routine. Our next one's a little bit bigger stretch. Uh -huh. Catching you here. Here we go. Probably could have pulled you on that one. You're pretty relaxed, but the protocol is three. <laughs> Feeling relaxed. Let that head just really relax. We stretch you up. Make this first breath the stretch and the second breath the pull. Okay, just kind of rechecking our work on upper traps. Working into some of the shoulder blade stuff. Front of the shoulder. Shoulders are doing pretty good right now. Mm -hmm. okay, just double checking that over on this side. Let's start with this arm on the hip. You might be best to lock in this in. Hold that. Good. Let that shoulder blade kind of drift back. There you go. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's okay. We're going to jump over to this side. Same thing. Just little stuff. Yeah. Oh, work our way down the arms. We'll start on your right. And relax here. Tight there. Mm. I was doing some exercises, those where you spread your finger at those little things that you put on your fingers. Hand, hand openers. Yeah. Yep, that'll get this zone. Grip an elbow here. That's great. Little things. This side, checking kind of the same way. Yeah, kind of similar. Yeah. Just a little bit of tension across the, the meaty part of the forearm here. So we could see, we see how tight that is when I play with it. You mm -hmm. see the dimple. Oh, yeah. So this one, yeah, it's pretty similar on that other side. You're also slender enough and toned enough that we get to see that, but mm -hmm. it's a little tight in there. Yeah, this arm, this wrist gives me some trouble. So I, I was doing those exercises and it kind of makes it go away a little bit. Oh, there you go, wow. That's, That's your nice. elbow side. There we go. A little wider. Yeah, yeah. a couple things in there. Yeah. That wrist always gives me trouble, seems like. But after I get adjusted, it goes away. It's almost like I got like a pinched nerve up in this area. But it, after I get adjusted, it, I don't get, it goes, my whole arm pain goes away. Yeah. It's almost like, the doctor said it was carpal tunnel, but it, 
as soon as this is as soon as I get adjusted, it goes away. So how can it be carpal tunnel? You know exactly. what I mean? Yeah. yeah, we'll go out and check Atlas and do Atlas. His information settled in here. And from where you're at, you can kind of see where I'm squeezing in here. For him, it's the other side that gets, it just doesn't have as much give as that side. And kind of the interesting thing is we're gonna adjust him from this side, but that side will feel better <laughs> when we set him up. Yeah. So go ahead and Lay down here as you know how. Get you centered up here. Just so we get that stylus right in here. Just feeling that atlas so we know where we're shooting for. Get right into it there. And here's our adjustment. Pressure, tap, just like that. Okay, sit on up. <clears throat> just recheck the same thing we were just feeling. That feels good, doesn't it? Mm. So just squeezing in there under that ear. The the tension softer through there. We know we got a good adjustment. Mm. He has a pretty good sense at this point. Yeah. Sometimes yeah. we have to do it twice. Sometimes yeah, it feels like that. To... Almost from the ear down, feels like it just loosens up. It's and then it feels like blood flow on this side. Like it, I can feel it right now going all over the side of my head. Like it warms it up. It really, yeah, it's weird. It feels it's like, funny, but it's cool. It's really interesting. All right. Well, thanks for joining us today, guys. Thanks for letting us film you. <laughs>